Hey guys, uh, so today I'm not going to be able to do too much work because I have to work a long shift, but uh, I had time to prep another section of this wall here uh, this morning, woke up early, and went to the gym, and while I was at the gym I saw that they were redoing their floors, and so I went out back and found a bunch of this flooring, uh, and this is like a fourth of what was being pulled out, so I'm gonna make another stop tomorrow or possibly tonight. They do have, you know, these these nail staple, I guess you can call them, uh, on the back there, so I'm gonna have to snip those off. Uh, and they're gonna need a little bit of buffering. But they're already sealed, which I'll probably end up taking off because you can see there's some aesthetic scratches on there. Um, and it was used in the gym. But uh, off free, it seems to be hard wood, and there are a few pieces like like this one here, which don't seem to be sealed at all. Uh, you got you know normal tongue and groove. Off free took me about uh, ten minutes to pick. Very easy, and I got a couple more boards that I found over there too. Uh, so yeah, I'm pretty psyched about that. I may be able to get all of my flooring for free if I keep this up surprised how easily this kind of stuff is to attain. All right guys, I'll uh, see you later. Hello again. Uh, so there's one other thing that I figured I'd mention today. Uh, I did pick those pieces of wood flooring today, uh, but last night I picked some more of these uh, bubble wrap reflective foil pieces and I separated them into two foot sections, which you can see here. Cash money, and so they're all two foot. I also have a stack there, uh, about 20. It's probably about 40, 30 or 40 here. Um, I'm going to put them into seven sheet layers here, which you've seen before if you watch some of the videos. And that goes right on the wall here. Uh, I don't mean to be so repetitive, but this is pretty much what I got going on right now. Uh, I did notice some kind of problems. Uh, just gonna take a little more work. So I was really excited about these uh, closed cell insulation uh, pieces. They were 14 inches wide and for the most part all of these were uh, 14 inches wide. But I found that over here it gets kinda crazy. Uh, these are about 16, this one's 15, and then we're back to 14 again, so having to kind of cut out a smaller piece, I'll end up taping these together. Uh, so it's not a really big problem, it's just kind of an annoyance. Um, be taping those together. Uh, what else I've been noticing too is, um, after I put the bubble wrap on here, um, it doesn't fit quite as nicely as I initially thought it would. Um, I had slight concerns that the pressure it was going to pull these off the wall. Um, I don't know quite yet if that's going to do that. It doesn't seem to be, you know, more than five to ten pounds of pressure. I don't really know how to measure that well, but um, it seems to be doing okay. I did notice some extra stability on the outside. Uh, pressing in doesn't seem flimsy, which is nice. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm working on right now. So I just got to do these, uh, same as these. Pretty much self-explanatory. Uh, I just want to let you guys know that what was going on? Alright guys, I will see you later.